What's up, my final loves? It's Miss Fina D coming to you all from Vienna Entertainment News. So someone got into my highlighter. Let's see, Olympia. Man, she love that Fenty. Dang. I'm trying to make gluten-free cookies, and the recipe calls for Z Z Zanning Zanningham gum and sugar. I don't generally eat sugar, so. Oh, granulated sugar. So, not quite sure what that is, but I don't think it's this. Okay, so I've been in the pantry for a minute. Um, baking is not my strength. Um, granulated sugar. Oh, wait, look. S swerve. <laughs> swerve on them. <laughs> I think coconut sugar might be better. I wonder how it would taste if I made them without sugar. Oh, there's a Zanhain gum. Mm -hmm. I can read, guys, just not these ingredients. See, like, I feel very uncomfortable with adding sugar. I don't like sugar. Sugar is not good for you. People that make sugar things, it's just not good for you. So we have this ingredients, this gum. I didn't know if sugar had so much melanin in it, but they had light brown, light brown, and some uh, semi-sweet chocolate chips. The recipe calls for vanilla extract, and I have almond. Um, I didn't really find vanilla, and I got tired of looking. Um, so I don't want to look anymore, so I'm going to go with this. I know you're out there thinking those cookies are going to be terrible, and that's true. Um... But hey, look at them nails. So now um, it calls for two teaspoons. I'm not sure which one is a teaspoon because um, they all have a tea by it. These cookies. <laughs> Suck. I was saying I don't use sugar, so it's one. Oh, it has a rock. Good pickup. Jeez. Oof. All right. I I quit. I mean. All right. I I quit. I mean. for baking powder and baking soda now I, I'm not sure about this but let's see what happens I was supposed to beat the ingredients separately but listen we all already know these cookies aren't going to taste good but it's for the best back live with chef Serena Williams kitchen so this is what happened to my cookies, but I'm gonna put some more butter in it to try to rescue them. So there's that, and just the rest of that. And pray for me, because I really wanted some cookies. Back now with Serena's Kitchen. I'm not sure how sanitary this is, but um, my wrist hurts. This is the only way to do it though. My elbow hurts, my biceps. Wait, oh. only five more. We have a Four. mixer. You can just use that. Three, two. Gonna need my physio to come work on my body and my arms because they're a little tight. But I'm gonna stay positive and keep going. I mean, that's a, that's looking like real cookie dough. Is that supposed to be? Too hot. Nailed it. Nailed it. Just cleaned my nails again.
So the cookies are still rising. Um, they, I have personally never heard of cookies rising, but I guess they said it could rise anywhere from an hour to two days. So I'm going to go ahead and let them rise. And I did get my nails done. So so I'm excited about that. I'll try to make the cookies tomorrow and see what happens. Bye. So I am, I let the cookies rest or raise for about 20 hours and they raised or whatever. And now I'm warming up some butter. You want to help mama make cookies? Cookies. Mm. A day later. Ooh. Oh no. Oh no. They're mm. hard. <laughs> That's natural. That's normal. Mm. Olympia will help. I'll do that. Yeah, see? You can fix it. Can you I hate cookies. You're looking for a soft, chewy cookie. Oh. That's why you need the xanthan gum. You can knock it. You can knock on it. It's the same as the counter. Boy, you messy, mm -hmm. messy baby. Hello. So Whoopi said she'd love to do a review on your chocolate chip cookies, but since you put cement mix in that last batch, um, we'll wait till you make another batch that doesn't involve cement mix, and then we'll try it. Uh, Serena, I'm actually I'm going to hang out with Martha Stewart in a little bit, um, and I was going to invite you, but I saw um, your your cookie making, and um, so did she, and she was like, Eesh. they're good, right? Peanut butter in it? Yeah, it's delicious. No, it's no peanut butter, but <laughs> <That's> the almond. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I had a lot of haters, namely uh, Damari, Colton, <laughs> Jeremy. But they're delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. I like molasses on oatmeal, but I avoid the brown sugar when I, like when I do molasses cookies because it's just too much. Too much. Too much. Are you trying to eat the chocolate chips? Uh huh. <laughs> Are you trying to eat the chocolate chips? They're yummy. <laughs> you ready? Mm hmm. Yum 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 yum. I'll this give you my recipe, but it takes two days to make. <laughs> yeah, so good. Uh, 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 so good. With all of the reality TV drama, okay, that I've been posting lately, I have some nice videos in there too. But I just felt like this was a nice, you know, just relaxing, fun, family slash, you know, hilarious, you know, just an amazing video to post to just step away from you know all of that back and forth and videos about you know certain housewives and things like that so it's nice to see serena hanging out with her family this took probably like three days i mean from her stopping to get her nails done then she went to the dentist right, i'm gonna bring you back Shreen, okay Maybe I should just pull out my tooth like DeAndre did and just go with the empty space on my tooth. What do you think? and her daughter or adorable daughter Olympia over there wasting some good Fenty beauty okay <laughs> to her hilarious friends it was just a fun filled video I love how supportive her husband is he came downstairs you know at the end assisted her by holding the camera and also her daughter was involved it would have been nice to see her be a part of the entire process but you know at her age she's into everything and Serena probably Probably wasn't going to be able to get through you know the cookie process if she was in the kitchen but it was nice to see her join them also yes girl you can tell that the whole sugar thing I'm right there with you I don't you know use sugar but oh they were hard 
and you know and her acting like she don't know what a teaspoon is and all of that I just that it was a cool video i have more content on serena but i simply wanted to keep this video 100 percent about her baking and any other additional um you know videos that i have i will be posting a completely separate video i am wishing serena and her family you know the best at the end of here, my friend, I love. Thank you all for your love and support. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and leave this video a thumbs up. Also, turn on notifications so when I do post, you where they're posted. And I will see you all in the comment section. Remember to always have the God bless attitude, which is being positive at all times and seeing the good in every situation. Have a great day, guys. God bless you.